Hello, I'm Bradley, and welcome to my channel. First things first, if you're new here, please subscribe. You don't have to, of course, but you'd really be helping me out by doing so. Okay, so let's jump straight in. Today, I want to talk to you about a new product which I've been using for about a week now, which is L'Oreal Paris Elvive, and this one is completely different. You would actually make them think that it would be skincare, but this is actually hair care. So it's a shampoo and a conditioner system. It is hydrohyaluronic. Now, very often, straight away, you'll probably be thinking hyaluronic acid, and you would be absolutely right. So this is a shampoo conditioner range. There is a treatment spray and a mask, a hair treatment mask. I haven't got those two. I've just looked at the shampoo and the conditioner, but that whole element around the hyaluronic acid is this whole sort of range. So if that's what you're really interested in, or you've been using it in your skincare and you're a man watching this or a woman watching this and you know that it's in your product which you use on a daily basis on your skin whether that be your, your eye area or whether that be sort of a product which you may use after shaving or if you're a lady using it because you don't necessarily um you're trying to battle the effects of sort of aging or if you're a man and you're quite tired skin then hyaluronic acid is a product which you'll probably be uh, aware of for skincare which works wonders so then put that into hair care and then you would be thinking of this super high rated amazing product and that's what we're going to have a look at today and see if it is just that. Okay so let's start with the shampoo I think. Okay so I've been using this for about a week now as you can see I'm about a third of the way down. Let's tell it about a little bit about it on the back here. So dehydrated hair so that's what it's aimed at. So it's a moisture boosting range shampoo and conditioner. So hyaluronic acid we know is a product boosts moisture. Very Often it will boost the tautness of your skin, so it will firm up the skin, it will pump energy into the skin, almost plump the skin back out. So with this, what it's targeting it is for dehydrated hair, what needs that voluptuous sort of lift, it needs a little bit of help, and perhaps it's a bit tired, perhaps it needs a bit more energy. So this is going to do that for you. This is what this range is aimed at. And I'm going to cover how well it does it. So okay, so L'Oreal Paris LV Hydro and then Hyaluronic. It's moisture boosting shampoo with hyaluronic acid okay so we know it's got that hero product in there so it's full bouncy hair with up to 72 hours of moisture dehydrated hair okay so we've got the shampoo the conditioner here why would i want that you're probably thinking okay so if you can have a look here it's a little bit difficult to see on here because i've got my hair um, uh, sort of combed back and then it's long so i've got it done up in the back here like a man's top knot but at the back here um and the style i've got here i've got blonde highlights throughout my hair but they've grown up quite a bit now but they did really dry my hair out blonde is a very high maintenance color it requires a lot of hydration on a daily basis if you're using heat if you're using uh products which can dry your hair out such as hairsprays all different styling products and then throw heat on there perhaps the environmental elements if we're in the winter at the moment so you've got that fact of having the central heating on a lot more and um, then you go out in all different elements your hair can really take a batter in as much as what your skin can so then a skincare product with hyaluronic acid would really rejuvenate and look after your skin that's what you would hope would be in this shampoo and conditioner range for this so the shampoo so as i say i've been using it for around a week now i'm going to tell you a little bit about it before i go into my opinion so dehydrated hair this is the first sign of damage with our moisturizing shampoo hair feels full and bouncy instantly revitalized with up to 72 hours of moisture hair looks shiny and feels intensively hydrated with no way down the power of hyaluronic acid inspired by skincare as we said hyaluron uh sorry lv hydro hyaluronic is infused with hyaluronic acid to create formulas to tackle dehydrated hair and it's got here how to use a plum wet hair massage into the scalp and rinse complete your routine with hydro hyaluronic conditioner or mask so we know that that's there another great thing our bottles are made in carbon neutral factory which is fantastic and our bottle is made of 100 percent recycled plastic okay it does say here the cap is not made from recycled plastic yet the bottle and cap are both recyclable okay that's really great to know that because i always think that i I want my I want my children's children children to enjoy this incredible planet we have so I think a company which is starting to take responsibility of its packaging and how it sources its ingredients amazing if I can do that then fantastic price wise three pounds fifty each okay 250 mils there are larger ones and they're six pounds each okay and the treatment spray which is a hyaluronic spray which does kind of a boosting effect on all of this that is the 13 pounds mark and the mask I think is around the seven and eight pounds mark please don't quote me on that that is my price sort of um from when I bought these about a week ago in Boots here in the UK. That's where I buy a lot of my products. Okay, so what do I think about this shampoo? So firstly, I think great packaging, great styling on the packaging, stands out, modern, super snazzy, great. Hyaluronic acid, I really, really like that idea that it's trying to mimic what you find in skincare and works so well at plumping the skin, kind of revitalizing and energizing the skin. Does it do the same for hair? Well, 
It does, to an extent. I think from looking at the packaging, you would think that this does... You'd think that it would make your hair absolutely so sleek and shiny that it would almost be like reborn. And my hair's not super, super dry, but it can be dry, and it is because of the blonde highlight. So I'm thinking, if you were platinum blonde, and you were a lady watching this, and you had that really glamorous platinum blonde hair, but it wasn't dry, but you were a little bit sort of cautious, and you wanted something to look after your hair, do you know what? I don't think this would quite be enough for you. If you're a man, then you've got super hair, uh, super thick hair, and hopefully you've got a super style, um, and you're thinking it's quite dry, then I think this would be good for you, but don't kind of be mistaken like that it's going to be super, super, super moisturising. Because it's got the hyaluronic acid in it, I did think that it would be more intensively moisturising. Um, I actually bought this and it's in our family bathroom and my mum has used this several times and she has almost waist length hair, um, uh, coloured black hair, um, fine but lots of it. Um, and she actually wasn't a fan of this and really didn't like this at all and found that it didn't actually do anything for her hair, which I thought was a bit disappointing. Myself, I found it gave me a little bit more of a better effect on my hair, but I have used other sort of normal standard shampoo and conditioners for just sort of balancing and just every day, which have given me equally the same effect. If I didn't know on the packaging that this shampoo had hyaluronic acid in it, I wouldn't scream out and tell you it's got hyaluronic acid in it or it's got some amazing product in there. So it is really good. I don't want to put a damper on it. It's really, really good. Um, but it's just with the hyaluronic acid element, you wouldn't know, I don't think, to be quite honest with you. Perhaps that is boosted by the spray, the leave-in spray, which I haven't got. I'm just going by the shampoo conditioner here. I'll be quite honest with you, for this brand, which I think is a high street brand, especially here in the UK, I did not warrant paying £3.50 each for these and then £13 for a spray on top. And then if I want the mask, that's another £8. For me, I find um, the range itself, L'Oreal LV is really good really really good but i think for having that element in it then clearly that's the premium sort of product what's ingredient what's in it so yes okay it requires a higher price range does it warrant it i'm not so sure i'm on the fence about that i really really am it's a great shampoo for dehydrated hair it's a great shampoo for colored hair again i keep coming back to you because it's saying it's got the hyaluronic acid in there i'm not sure um for me, certainly doesn't stand up to a cream or a face product or something with hyaluronic acid in it. I have used that um, for tiredness and sort of energy around my eyes and things. You wouldn't think there was any comparison. I know it's difficult to compare skincare to hair care, but I think it's really great. It looks after your hair. Have I noticed a, a transformation in my hair? It's nice. It's moisturized. It's really, um, it's a great product. I love L'Oreal products. Um, I'm just a little bit on the fence. I don't want to say a negative review, but I'm just on the fence about this one. Let's move on to the conditioner. So the moisture locking conditioner. So again, of course, pretty much the same here. I'll just read it for you again for you. So the dehydrated hair. This is the first sign of damage. Our moisturizing conditioner instantly detangles hair and locks in moisture for up to 72 hours for bouncy, free flowing hair with no way down. Hair looks shiny and feels intensively Hydrated. The power of hyaluronic acid, inspired by skincare, Alviv Hydro Hyaluronic is infused with hyaluronic acid to create formulas to tackle dehydrated hair. Okay, so it says here to leave them for a minute and then rinse. Um, I found that wasn't enough, to be quite honest with you. Now, it is a real rich, creamy formulation. The shampoo, again, um, is a little bit sort of uh, viscous. It's a bit more thin to sort of, uh, when you're shampooing your hair, it's a little bit more of a thinner consistency. Um, I thought that wasn't that detangling. The conditioner, really nice and creamy. However, I've left this in my hair and I actually um, left this in for about 30, 40 minutes. I went from home to up super, super early, washed my hair and thought, okay, let's do a really great thorough sort of experience review with this. Left it in, went on a couple of calls first thing in the morning. Believe you me, nobody's seen me, let's put it that way. Um, then I took a break and washed that out um, when I had a break in the morning um, and then sort of shook my hair a little bit, seen how it was and it just slipped it back in a style like this. I've used it again this morning and the conditioner is great, but again, with that hyaluronic acid element in it, you would think that it would be super, super like reborn hair, whereas it's not, to be quite honest with you. It is moisturized, it is nice, but I just expected it's here, but I expected it to be here. Um, so I kind of feel a little bit let down by it because it's for dehydrated hair at the end of the day. Now, the mask may well be super, super nourishing and you may get that effect from there. The spray, of course, you may again. But do I really want to pay another £20 on top of paying nearly £7 for a 250ml shampoo 
and a 250 mil conditioner. I have paid more, but I think to be honest, when you're talking about hyaluronic acid, you either need to be up there with it or you need to really deliver it the cost what you're delivering at, if that makes sense. Um, so really, really great products. The conditioner is super creamy. It does look after the hair, it does nourish the hair, but just not as much as what I would expect of a product which is portraying that it has hyaluronic acid in there. But I do like it. I'm not going to say, I'm going to, out of 10, I'd probably give this a six and a half or seven. Um, maybe me being generous, but I do like it. As I'm saying this, I'm feeling really, really bad saying this because I like L'Oreal. One of my favorite products is L'Oreal Professional by Surioxal, and that is amazing stuff. This same level? No. Um, but I do like it for an everyday product with hyaluronic acid for if you want to, if, if it's got that in there. I mean, it's, it's saying it's got it, it's in there, it's got it in there, but you wouldn't necessarily know, to be quite honest with you, I don't think. It's got really nice smell, quite a feminine smell, quite a floral smell, but nice. It wouldn't it wouldn't be something which a man couldn't use. Um, but yeah, I really, really like it, but I don't love it, as to speak, um, because I just think for dehydrated hair, if you're talking about hyaluronic acid, it needs to really hit that top-notch mark for me, being that you've got that premium ingredient in there, and it kind of doesn't. It just misses the mark for me. Really great, really great ingredients. Love that it's responsible packaging, responsible sourcing of the ingredients. Love that. Love that it's for dehydrated hair. Love that it's moisture boosting, moisture locking. Brings me on to the last element, 72 hours of moisture. That I agree with. That I do agree with because I left my hair one day, but then I would never, ever not um, wash my hair then the following day because blonde, of course, is fragile. Um, then I slick some sort of uh, uh, some sort of leave-in conditioner spray and then coat my hair back but then before I'd done that my hair was really nicely moisturized the only reason I did spray the leave-in uh, spray throughout my hair which isn't the one with this range it is a different one it's just because of the little single hairs which you get coming through which stand out if you haven't got anything to slick them back with so from that aspect I do agree with the 72 hours even though I haven't quite done the 72 hours I've done the 48 hours it does really leave the hair moisturized for 72 hours just not the way which i would expect with hyaluronic acid in it okay so thanks very much for watching this uh, review i really really hope you've enjoyed it i very much looked forward to bringing this to you i'm not saying this is a negative one it just doesn't quite hit the mark i'd expect it to be so i'm going to say six and a half seven out of ten for this one i don't normally do that but i think that just helps me get what i'm trying to say across more clearly if you do have any questions at all it is a very new product um it's it's hit boots here in the uk relatively recently um i've been using it for about the last week would i buy it again yes i would absolutely especially if it's on offer um, so yes, I certainly would. Um, I would recommend you to try it as well for all different hair types. Um, and yes, I've really enjoyed doing this. I hope you've enjoyed watching. And until next time, I look forward to seeing you again soon. And take great care and I'll be seeing you then. Bye for now.